Introducing first, from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 238 pounds, Cole G. Man. Guys, there's a lot to unpack here as we try to set the table for this big three-on-three -three matchup. You're right, Michael, with six dominant superstars competing here, there's so many different angles we could take. It's almost impossible to choose where we go first. From Osaka, Japan, weighing in at 254 pounds, Hiro Yosef Ted Zeng. Plenty of action coming up as we have six of WWE's top names ready to go here. Oh man, Michael, six man matches like this always remind me of world class back in the 1980s. And their partner, from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 217 pounds, Cho North Martha Hero. Now time for a huge six-man tag team match. And I can't think of any competitors I'd rather see go at it right now than these six superstars. This one's gonna be great. And their opponent, first, from Japan, weighing in at 287 pounds, K.G. Moda. It doesn't get much better than this guy. Six-man tag team action coming up next. Actually, Cole, it can get better than this. Let me just find where they plugged in Saxon's mic. Give me a minute. I'll take care of it. From Japan, weighing in at 238 pounds, Finch Warlord. We're just moments away from what will likely be one of the most exciting six-man tag team matches we've seen in a very long time. Well, given the two teams we have assembled here tonight, I would say I have no choice but to agree with you, Cole. And their partner, from Owida, 
at Japan, weighing in at 227 pounds, the dragon, Yu G. Amy. An exciting six-man tag team match coming up here, gentlemen. Michael, ever since this match was announced, I've gone back and forth as to which team I think will walk away victorious. At this point, I'd say it's just too close to call. This is a match that Jeez. doesn't need a lot of hype or description. Just look in the ring. This is going to be an incredible six-man tag match. Oh, and a snap there! That'll give you a whiplash. And look at hung up by the sec. Get in there, ref. If you ask me, guys, this match alone is worth the price of this month's WWE Network subscription. Of course, there's other great matches. He might have it. Doesn't appear to be locked in very well. And he escapes the submission. And good thing, that could have been disastrous. I think a lot of people share Corey's earlier sentiment. This match is undoubtedly one of the highlights of this pay-per-view, which Byron is stacked with a series of amazing matches. Yeah, we get to sit here and call all of them? Sometimes I have to pinch myself. I still can't believe how lucky we are. No surprise that the sold-out signs went up early on this one, guys. Anytime a WWE pay-per-view rolls into town, you can bet it will be the hottest ticket around. Corey mentioned earlier that the sold-out signs went up fairly quickly for this one. Or as WWE Hall of Famer Gorilla Monsoon might have said, the SRO signs went out early for this one. Oh, man. I don't know if there was an announced pairing more entertaining than Gorilla Monsoon and Bobby Heenan. True legends. He's starting to stumble here. He looks to be a little surprised right now. And I can tell you exactly what his partners are thinking right now. Why in the world did we agree to team with this guy? Look at this, Byron. I don't think he's got it completely locked in. Oh, and he slips out. Wow, looked to me like he had it locked in pretty good. I guess not. Here we are, guys, more than three decades after the WWE helped revolutionize pay-per-view television, and we're still going strong. Only now, unlike back then, the best way to catch a WWE pay-per-view is on the WWE Network. I'd have to agree with you, Michael. The best place to watch pay-per-views is on the WWE Network, which, as you know, also features thousands of hours of programming, including one of my personal favorites, Legends House. Hey, you know what? It should do a reality show with us. That would be great. Sitting next to you each week is more than enough, Saxton. There's not enough money on the planet Earth to get me to live in a house with you. Forget it. There's been a lot of great moments on pay-per-view over the years. And for me, one of my favorites was watching Kurt Angle's debut match at the 1999 Survivor Series. All my buddies and I gathered around the TV cheering on our hometown boy, Kurt Angle. Big collision on the splash. Back to Kurt Angle's WWE debut, 
We should note that he defeated Sean Stasiak that night using his patented angle slam. And from there, the rest is history. Speaking of history, longtime WWE fans may remember Sean Stasiak's father, Stan Stasiak, who's famous for defeating Pedro Morales for the WWE. He's looking at it. You gotta believe this one's over. Can he finish the job? Whoa, he, he works his way out. A bit of a Houdini job right there. Nailed it. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Not today. Comes in off the tag. Oh, and Enziguri! He's got to remember he has two partners ready to enter the fray here. At this point, he really has to think about mixing it up a bit. Maybe implement more of a power game into his offense. He has to be disappointed in this performance. He really is so much better than what he's shown so far tonight. Oh, nasty impact. Tap. What's he gonna do? Ooh, what impact. You have to like his chances here. Guys, there's something special about competing on a WWE pay-per-view event. Sure, having a match on Raw or SmackDown is absolutely amazing. And he breaks free just when you thought he was out of this one. What a strike. How much more punishment needs to be dipped out? Just finish it. And his chances of winning the six-man tag team match appear to be slipped. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. I agree with your earlier point, Michael. There's nothing like the bright lights of a WWE pay-per-view. But there's also nothing like the pressure of competing on a WWE pay-per-view. A loss here could set you back quite a bit. Yeah, but a win? Now that could be career change. Think about it. Picking up a win while the entire WWE Universe is watching on the WWE Network, it doesn't get much better than that. Tagged in. All the way crashing down. Almost just a... And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Right in the mouth. Relax. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He might have it. Beautiful technique. He's in the driver's seat now. Okay, this time has to do it. Oh, and he breaks free. But the damage might have already been done. This might be it. Oh, my. I'm not sure how much he has left. Sit out, pile driver. Big move coming. Wait for it. Boom, oh, impact. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. He's in a very bad way. Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. Headbutt. Boom. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. No, there's the reversal. Both teams working well here together. That's not always the case in a six-man tag team match. Oftentimes, you'll see personal agendas eat their way into the action. Both teams working well here together. That's not always the case in a six-man tag team match. Oftentimes, you'll see personal agendas eat their way into the action. Just a step quicker, it looks like. 
Harsh impact. He's got to hurry if he doesn't want to get counted out here. Time's certainly not on his side, Michael. Eight. Great match so far, guys, which should come as no surprise. Superstars always seem to elevate their games when it comes to pay-per-view. Oh, I hate to see it end like this. A lot of good action in that one. Here's another look. He ain't messing around. Oh, I can't believe this. Yeah, he's putting in the work. Ain't nothing better than action like this. Here are your winners. Cole G. Man. Hero, Yosef, Ted, Zen. And Cho, North, Martha, Hero. And the official decision is a count out. If you're not feeling good about yourself after a win like